Hello, welcome back to Digital Titans again. I know this is this is a session that's coming out after a long time, uh, especially a video session. Uh, I hope you guys are all aware that we have a new podcast that we have launched, which is about uh, talking about the new updates and answering any questions and troubleshooting anything related to digital marketing for you guys. Now, if you could quickly go to www.titans.digital, you would have uh, you you could have a look at the recent podcast that we have launched. Now, this session is exclusively about something uh, which is very important to all the content specialists and all the people who are working on digital marketing and all the digital nomads that, that are out there. And this, will, this session will help you understand uh, the potential of starting a YouTube channel and uh, having a, a strong set of followers on Instagram and how these things could, could help you and to, to, to make money online or to become an influencer and just uh, do anything related uh, to earning some kind of passive income for you. Now, to start with, the, the, thing that we, the topic that we're going to talk about today is something called a social blade. It is one of the most uh, important tools. Unfortunately, it is not known by a lot of people. Now, what does social blade do is it just tells you what is the potential or the possibility of uh, the popularity or the chances of making money and how much could you make with either of these channels, whether it's a YouTube channel or a Twitch channel that you have or an Instagram profile or your Twitter handle or Daily Motion or Mixer, anything of these sort, right? Now, what we would be looking at is we would be quickly looking at, I have uh, pulled out a few profiles, one for Instagram and I have about three channels on uh, YouTube for, to demonstrate this and I also have something, uh, some profile that on Twitter that I've pulled for you. Now, this is an Amazon Twitter handle and this these are the three YouTube channels that I would be talking about today, right? And I have also the FedEx Instagram profile uh, with about 90.5 thousand followers for you just to see how these things could be monetized, right? Now, first things first, how do you access Social Blade? Just go to google.com and say Social Blade, you will get a listing that talks about social blade and come here right now what this does is these are the supported platforms that it has and these are the top list of things that you could look at at any at any point in time if you want to look at the top 50 youtubers top 100 youtube channels top 100 to 500 youtube channels right and you could also look at what the, by by country and you could also look at by categories what are the most uh, popular youtube uh, channels right now if you see anything related to let's say if you want to look at what are the most popular uh, how-to categories or style categories, you could just click on that and it will tell you a list of uh, YouTube channels and they have sorted it on the basis of the grade, which is A plus being the top and then you have A and then you have A minus sometimes. There you go and you have B, B plus, B minus. Now these are the list of categories and what of, of YouTube channels and the number of YouTube views and the subscriber count and how many uploads do they have so far not just that it just doesn't stop there it will also give you an indication of how much these guys potentially make or what is the estimated yearly earnings right now let's go step by step i just don't want to put everything together and and boggle you with the numbers now let's go step by step and let's see how you can anybody can look at the statistics for a particular youtube channel or a twitter handle or an instagram profile now since we're talking about YouTube channels first. Let's talk about Business Insider, which is a very popular YouTube channel. Now, let's go to Social Media, uh, Social Blade, the put in the URL and just search. Now, when you search for this YouTube channel, it will tell you what this channel has, how many uploads does it have, what is the subscriber count, or how many video views does this have, the country it's based out of, the category of the channel, right, and when was it created. Now scroll down, it will give you a grade of the channel. As I said, A plus being the top category. Now this is B plus, right? It will give you a rank in terms of the subscribers. In terms of video views, where is this particular YouTube channel ranked at? Now Social Blade has a separate rank for itself. And these are the amount of estimated monthly earnings, right? Now one thing I, I strongly suggest everybody uh, to do it is very easy to get carried away by looking at these numbers and say that oh business insider is making one hundred twelve thousand dollars a month now it's it's very easy to get carried away because these numbers are are very interesting to look at and they could also uh, bump up your your expectations now 
to avoid that here is a very very uh, factual piece of information for you guys if you want to look at the subscribers if you want to look at the uploads if you want to look at the video views you're fine to do that just go ahead and and you could trust and believe these numbers however when you come to the earnings nobody is really sure about the exact amount of earnings any of these channels make right so what i would want to do what i would strongly want to emphasize here to everybody who is looking at this video right now is do not blindly believe these numbers now the you can use these numbers just as a as an indication to arrive at an approximate number of uh, amount of dollars that these guys make but do not blindly take these numbers and don't beat yourself up to it right now if you scroll down you will also see on a daily basis from 11th of may until 24th of may what are the subscriber increase right and then they are looking they're showing you the video views they're also showing you the estimated earnings on a daily basis right as i said do not beat yourself up to these numbers just get an idea of the approximate amount of you can you can arrive at a ballpark figure of how many uh, uh, views and subscribers these guys have and what is the approximate amount of estimated earnings right now the default estimated cpm range for social media uh, social blade is 0.25 dollars to 4 dollars now this is how uh, they get paid per impression having said that i would really want to reiterate the fact that please do not look at these numbers and and take them blindly now let's go to another channel which is vimeo now I've put this url here and start searching for the statistics they have two channels let's say this is the channel that i would want to look at so these are this is set to private so we wouldn't really have an indication of that now let's say dropship lifestyle let's go back let's go back again put in the channel url and see how many subscribers or how much these guys are approximately looking at making right now while business insider had a, a grade of b or b plus which i'm not sure now this url or this channel has a grading of c plus this is the subscriber rank the video uh, view rank scroll down and this is the approximate amount of earnings that these guys make now the point being this will give you an approximate estimate of what you could make when you have these kind of subscribers and it it helps you to you know step up your game and see what others are doing what now it is very diff i could you could ask me that i can get the same information by looking at their uh, statistics on youtube right now look at this this is this is 44325 subscribers now how different is that from this but it's a pro it is exactly the same right now there is no change in the number of subscribers or the in the data that you see but you don't get a split of this on a daily basis you you don't get to see these kind of approximate cpm views or earnings that these guys make so it's very good and it is a very good reference point for you to understand where you stand right in terms of these and and it will also help you set an expectation of what you need to aim at if you want to achieve where these guys are right now let's also look at how instagram happens now what we have seen so far are the youtube channels right let's quickly go back and let me paste the instagram profile url and this is the it, it gives you a different set of statistics altogether right now these are the number of followers let's verify if that's the same now here it says 90000 followers now the tool is not updated accurately so it says about 86000 now scroll down if you want to look at a live subscriber follow account at this point in time click on that live option and let's wait what to to see what it says right in the meantime let's see other things that fedex has right now these are this it says is the uh, it's not yet updated completely it, i think it it should take a couple of minutes for you to show the updated version now let's go back and see the other aspects of you know on a daily basis these are the number of followers these are the number of you know and this is the following list and these are the followers count and it gives you on a daily basis right now you could also look at the followers increase on certain days and what is the daily split of these things and you could also get the monthly averages all right so now the last thing that we need to look at is let's take a twitter profile or twitter handle and see how this impacts on what kind of data this showcases using social blade when you do that just say search and this is the follower rank and this is the average number of retweets that amazon uh, twitter handle gets 
on an average it gets these 85 likes now this kind of data is very difficult to get right now you look you can look at these you will know how many people are following how many people are followers how many tweets how many lists and so on but it's very important to understand the average split of this data and uh, a bifurcation of this data and these kind of things will will definitely make you know you wonder about okay these are the kind of numbers that amazon does now if it's as i said it serves as a very strong reference point to see where you stand and how you can achieve to to have to to arrive at these kind of numbers right now as i said this is a very very interesting tool but also please 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 understand that do not beat yourself up to the revenue figures and don't get depressed or don't don't think too much about it and say that okay these are the exact numbers these these guys are making this is an approximation and this is a calculated figure it, there is no basis for these numbers no uh, social blade does not get access to the bank accounts of amazon or or business insider to see how much these guys are exactly making now this is just an approximation so with that uh, point in mind now use this as a reference point to see how things are with the leading youtube channels and you will also get to know what kind of numbers you need to have if you want to bump up your uh, popularity of the channel or if you want to be one of the top most channels available now as i said you could also use these categories to see what are the top channels top twitch channels what are the top instagram profiles and and it will give you a very good reference point and one thing that you should not forget is let's talk about instagram if i go to instagram now these are the top 10 followed instagram users now if this is what i look at now instagram has a a++ rating now let's say selena gomez has uh the same rating as well and these are the kind of followers that they have now let's say i want to look at her profile now what this does is this not only tells you the statistics of this particular instagram user or profile it will also give you an idea of what these guys are doing right that you could you know look at replicating on your own instagram profiles to get these kind of numbers now we can have a look at what kind of pictures are being posted agreed she's a celebrity and she would have a much broader reach than we can but i'm i'm pretty sure that she's doing most of the things right and that will give you an idea of to uh, as to what you need to keep in mind while building your profile or your channel now this is it's it's all learning at the end of the day and and this is how you you make uh, things count and you do one thing at a time and slowly build your channels or profiles which could lead you to make more money or monetizing it in the long run I hope you enjoyed this session and if you did please do subscribe to our YouTube channel which is Digital Titans let me show you quickly so you just go to youtube.com and search for Digital Titans and there you go this is my channel and you can just subscribe to this channel here thank you so much for your time and have a great day ahead happy learning until then cheers